Evening, I'm David Scott. We are following developing news tonight out of central Austin. Police say the standoff between the SWAT team and a person has ended. It happened on Red River near East 44th. Omar Lewis, live on the scene tonight with the very latest. Omar? Good evening, Dave. Very tense moments here. Almost a scene out of a movie. Now, this standoff situation lasted for about three and a half hours. APD tells us a man barricaded himself inside of his home with a weapon. He did have previous mental health issues. Just moments ago, they got that man to come out of the house, and he was taken into custody. Police are working to figure out why this all happened. With the help of several other agencies, SWAT and bomb squads arrived here on the scene at the 4300 block of Red River. Police say around 1230 this afternoon, a woman flagged down an officer driving by. She asked for help, and that's when it all started. Now, police have not clarified if there were any hostages inside of that home. But after hours of negotiating and talking with the man, he did come out of the house and surrendered himself to police. He was uh, described as a 60-year-old white male with previous mental health issues. What those issues are right now, I'm, I don't know. Uh, SWAT was able to get containment on scene, and actually just a couple of minutes ago, the subject was safely uh, taken into custody by the SWAT team with no injuries. Now, police say all these crews here on the scene is typical for any hostage or standoff situation. They're now investigating and looking into that man's mental health issues. They haven't released a name yet, but we will get that information to you as soon as possible. Now, here on the scene, crews are packing up and getting ready to leave. They just opened this road here, Red River, moments ago. For now, we're live near Hyde Park. Omar Lewis, KXAN News.